Welcome, this is Lance Mueller from Magnet Forensics. And in this video, we're gonna briefly demonstrate the AVI carving feature that is now included in version 6.2 of IEF. So on the screen right now is version 6.1. And I just wanna briefly show you a demonstration of the current version 6.1 and then what 6.2 will have the ability to do in relation to AVI carving. So I'm gonna just carve or search a, so I'm just going to analyze a evidence file very quickly. I have one right here called flash disk. And I'm gonna go ahead and open this up, say next. I'm gonna do a full search. That includes unallocated space. And I'm gonna say next. And I'm gonna uncheck all the artifacts. And I'm just gonna scroll down here to videos. And then say next. And I'm going to go ahead and run this. And this will now collapse and an IEF status screen will be displayed as the search goes on. And this will, this will um, complete very quickly because it's a, it's a very small image that we're looking for. We're only looking for one artifact and that's uh, basically videos. So the search is complete and you can see that we have no artifacts returned. That's because on the evidence file that I've loaded, there are some AVIs that were present, but then they've been deleted, so they are now in an allocated space. So version 6.1 does not have the ability to carve AVIs out of unallocated space. So now I'm gonna go ahead and close this, and I'm gonna go ahead and bring up 6.2, and I'm gonna do exactly the same search. I'm gonna click on images, I'm gonna choose that same EO1 file, say next, I'll do a full search and I'll unselect all the options or all the artifacts except videos. I'll say next and I'm gonna give it an evidence number, number one, and say find evidence. And again, this will collapse, a status screen will now open and then the report viewer will also appear showing the um, hits as they arrive. So search is done. And we now have three carved videos, which is exactly what I put on the flash drive before I deleted them. And so basically we now have the ability to carve AVIs, tell you exactly where we found it, uh, how big it is. And then you have multiple options here. You can right click and export this data uh, that's shown in this table view out to CSV or any of these other formats, or if you wanna actually export the car video out, you can choose this and it will actually take the AVI and export it out of, out of IEF into a folder that you designate and then you can then copy it or pass it on to an investigator or view it uh, if you wish. So that sums up the new features in 6.2 relating to how we carve AVI files now.